our purpose was to get Italy on the map situated in a much firmer and clearer way than it was before for participants to this conference that is a key to the mechanical engineering sector in the United States. And I think by soliciting uh, collaborations and uh, exchanges uh, both on the uh, scientific and the industrial side, we have done some work towards this purpose. It was in, impressive to come here to look for the organization uh, from uh, uh, ITA, from the Italian uh, trade agency, and also for the network and the technical level of the conference. Uh, yes, innovation uh, could come still from uh, Italy. I work for a very innovative company and uh, I appreciate this event, this round table, because it was a good opportunity to meet uh, companies, uh, university, to start talking about uh, potential collaboration. And uh, it is a concrete way uh, to start uh, with a concrete uh, collaboration. Ita, I see the Italian trade agency. I'm very glad to be invited to participate in this round table where we discuss about competitiveness of Italy. And I think the better takeaway that I can do from this round table is the fact that beauty for Italy has been important for so many years and it will be important also in the next years. The panelists were phenomenal. I, I was amazed at the, the high level uh, that they were able to to bring here to Salt Lake City, Utah, which is uh, not typically a, a, a tourist destination, so we, we appreciated them coming here for that. Uh, and it, was, it was wonderful to get to see them. And now we're very honored to take part in such a prestigious event. The conference went very, very well, and the uh, speaking and many questions from the audience, which was excellent. And we'd like to thank Marco and Bart and the rest of the agency for uh, putting on such a fantastic occasion. Very privileged. Thank you. It's been a great honor to be invited to this event and also I really appreciate I make it. It's a great opportunity for us as a researcher from the university world to have this opportunity to networking and show our results to a diverse community of scientists and partners from industry. So I hope to be here again soon and thank you again for this opportunity. We really appreciate the um, the workshop today because we are now in a specific um, research uh, workshop uh, conference where we are able to identify which are the potential area of collaboration we would like to develop within the US counterpart. And we are trying to support the science to science collaboration in a more effective way. Uh, the takeaway uh, piece, I think that here we had the opportunity to outreach our activities and uh, to see that from the initial pilot that we developed in the last two years, we can really grow the kind of uh, interaction between the two states, uh, between Italy and the US, and uh, from there build something that could be not only uh, developed on the science to science level, but on a more programmatic level. If I had uh, sort of one takeaway that, that struck me was this, uh, there, there were sort of two concepts. One was there was a lot about the idea of beauty, and to me I think beauty involves many things. Beauty involves a lot of robots moving very fast, very close, very, you know, producing a car every 30 or 40 seconds. That's beauty. That's, uh, that, that's beauty in the highest sense. And the other one was, um, I think it was Paolo who pointed out from uh, Industrial Premium, was the concept of competitiveness, that Italy is a competitive place and uh, that anyone would want them to, uh, to collaborate and work with Italian companies, Italian universities, and tie into that competitive nature. So I think those were sort of the things that, that really struck out to me in the past.